Oh yeah, there we go. Ha <laughs> ha. Just play around with it. You'll get it. All right, there we go. Now we have tear marks. Woo! Okay, also, I forgot to say. Do a, some bruising around your nose and your eye area. Because if you break your nose, your eye is going to be red, uh, going to be bruised as well. This is probably something that you should do before you do the, the saline. Okay, that's good. Whatever. So, and if your tear marks aren't pro predominant enough, more mascara. That's all you gotta do. And my shirt is getting, like, <laughs> I gotta show you on my shirt right now. <laughs> yeah, you gotta get into the roll. Okay, so the next thing, fake blood. This stuff is like a dollar, a tube. Take some, and first, put it on your cuts. Squeeze some and let it run down. That way it'll run in a way that if you were actually hit in that area, it would actually run. Get some up in your hairline and let it run down. So that way, and, and on Halloween, I'm not gonna do it right now because I don't want my hair to get all wet, but on actual ha Halloween, I poured it in my hair and had it run down. It's about to run in my eye. <laughs> okay, so. So I'm coming from this one. And I'm gonna catch this because I don't want it to get all over my shirt. <laughs> now, from your lip. It's, I don't know why I didn't think about this, but if you're gonna do a cut on your lip, do it on your bottom lip. So when you do your fake blood, it's not running. But. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> okay, there we go. Now, so you have your blood coming from your predominant cuts. But there are also little cuts on your face. So, get some blood and just start. You don't want it to look fake, but get some blood on your face. You're not going to be pretty right after you got in a car accident. Okay, that's good for the most part, except for this one. This looks, looks this doesn't look very good. And if you are, like, really into the whole, you have to make it look true, then you can make your own fake blood. I don't know how to do that, but I'm sure that there are other videos here on YouTube that will tell you how. Now, get some more tear your marks and this stuff isn't gonna burn your eyes so don't worry about that now the last thing that will make it true to a car accident is a seat belt bruise get a shirt wear a shirt that's low cut first of all and just get a bunch of eyeshadow purple and brown on your fingers and just take it and start going like this get your actual skin like rub it where it's really red. Get it coming across your chest. If you're the driver, make sure you get it coming across the right side of your chest. If you're a passenger, get it here. You know, make it look real because otherwise people are just gonna think, oh, okay, she is something with a bunch of blood coming off of her. That way they know that you were in a car accident. On Halloween at my, <laughs> I had my, my, sorry, my eyes are starting to kind of burn from all the mascara. At Halloween, I had a shirt, a sign on my shirt that said, don't drink and drive. Now, I'm sorry, the last thing to really make it look real is trusty toilet paper. Get a little wad of it and stick it in your nose. Make sure you can't see it. That way, look at my nose. It's swollen. I don't know if you can really tell, but that's too much. Well, okay. And then, wherever your lip, you had the cut, ugh. Okay, I shouldn't have done the cut there. Okay, wh whatever. Wherever your cut is, put some toilet paper underneath the cut because now it's swollen. You have a swollen nose. On the side that you got the bruising, 
do the toilet paper. Do the opposite side with the cut or down on the bottom. And stick some toilet paper up in there. So that it looks like it's really cut. So, I mean, this is a... There's your... There's this cut. And then there's that cut. And then your lip. Don't mind that. <laughs> your lip. And then your nose is all swollen on this side. So, yeah. Ugh. Toilet paper's not good. I did it with sponges. So, yeah. That's how you become a drunk driving victim. So, yeah. Thanks for reading and subscribing, everybody. Bye.